All right, I think I'm feeling a little bit better. Getting back into the spirit of things here. Took a while, but feels like our magical abilities are, are working out. We can handle this Mizolft area. All the crazy Dweemer con con constructions and then evil insects and Falmer and all this monstrosities around here. My good buddy Stenvar's got my back. Looks like this is where we're really trying to go. Let's go check that other room out last last time, not too long ago. We were uh we were checking out a room down here. And it may have some goodies. Possibly. I feel obligated to look inside these things, because you often get soul gems. So even if I didn't kill them myself, we can still get goodies. And healing potions always useful. Another bed. Some some sort of weird potion. And a chest. There we are. Um, an orcish greatsword. Now, that may be something that my pal is interested in. Probably less so the shield. Well, Stenvar, it is your lucky day, my friend. Yes. I would like to give you a new weapon. Uh, let's see, how do we do that? Yes, I'll give you sure. one of my Feel awesome weapons. Feel free to hand me all the gold you want. Ha ha ha. Here you are, my friend. So you have an iron greatsword that does 14 damage. Well, I happen to have an orcish greatsword that does even more damage. I need to get him armor and stuff too. That'll be awesome. I don't think he will actually use the shield. I think he's two-handed weapons only. So we'll orcish. Now, if I remember the mechanics correctly, when it says when it says 17, that's how much damage I would do if I wielded it. He should be doing much more actually because he's got uh, uh, much more two-handed skill. And unfortunately, he'll probably wear through the uh, the enchantment before very long. But still, an orcish greatsword will be much better than iron, just on its own. Let's go. Does that thing look beastly? Look at that beastly sword there. Good job. Good job. All right. Very happy I went back that direction. <laughs> That's going to be useful. And this was the door to the next area. So we are ready to proceed. All right, Mzolft Air Ad Adrum Adrum Adrum. I don't know. Aerodrome. All right, Stenvar, are you ready? Let's uh, let's go back to attack mode. Actually, right. I was decided that uh, healing you was useful, so there we are. Now, if you recall, I sort of empowered my magic to charge up. Which means not missing is even more important. There you are, Stenvar. Good job, buddy. I'm not certain that my extra three seconds charge is doing a whole lot to help. It's hard to say for sure. I guess I'll just trust it. Yeah, you know, it probably is doing more damage. It probably is. By the way, Stan, how you doing, buddy? What? Hey. Gotta keep, gotta keep practicing. Gold ore and gold. Har har. Actually, wait a second. Give me that spade tail. Got a valuable fish on him. All right. I think I accidentally picked something up that I didn't want to. It probably took some Dwemer craftsman a year to build one of those things. Yeah, you you keep saying the same things. It's starting to make me wonder about your sanity, bit, old pal. Hmm. Where will they come from next? That's quite the tapestry, actually. Look at that thing. Beautiful. Oh, that's actually... It is healing hands. I thought that was a ward for a second. Okay, so we've got one Falmer up there. I think I can get from here. And time. Uh, just a little bit too slow. Now, he has a ward up. Unfortunately. Oh, boy! This is going to be a very large fight. So we're going to try to be magicka efficient here as much as I can. And I'm going to try to keep my buddy alive. Oh, oh no, ranged. 
You're all right, right? You're good. Now, getting that restoration. Whoa, how am I almost dead? Oh, man. Stenvar, you're just going to have to hold on for a second. Must have taken an arrow while I was out there. Get away from me. Nope. Oh, dear. I'm not doing good. Oh, boy. Come on. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Okay, we got that one. Now, that mage... I'm not doing so good against the mage. Okay. That's what the lightning spell's for. Now, it doesn't always seem to work. Like, he still keeps casting spells on me, even when I'm doing it, but... Alright. Let's actually charge this up. Broke through his uh, barrier at the very least. Falmer Gloom Lurker. Oh, he's not your average Falmer Magician. Oh boy. I did not do very much damage to him, did it? Oh, we're gonna have a shooting fight out. Well, my lightning is a little bit quicker than your fireballs. Come on, get rid of your ward. I don't want to waste my magicka. Oh, is that... Oh, another one. How did I... What happened there? Oh, this is not good. Another archer. I do not have the magicka ready for this right now. Oh, this is not good. We're gonna... We're gonna have to potion up a little bit here. Get an extra shot. I gotta take this guy out. Oh, miss is not good at all. Not good. And I can't... Oh, this is not good. There's nowhere to run back to, so I have to load a new area. I'm sorry, Stenvar. I'm sorry, my friend. I do not have enough magic to deal with this many creatures. I guess I could pull up my staff. Forgot about that. It doesn't do a lot of damage, though. So are you coming through the door as well? Sometimes they follow you. Not necessarily always. There's more down here? Must not be. Must just be a bug. There can't be any back here. We cleared this area out. Totally cleared that area out. Alright, so how am I going to survive in there? I mean, I can, I can wait a minute here and let my magic have fully recharged. Pick that up while I'm here. I could cast uh, my oak flesh before I head out, but it only lasts a minute and it won't protect me against the mage. This is going to be very tricky, my friends. Very tricky indeed. I will see you on the other side. All right, the foolish Falmer were not smart enough to follow me through the door, so it gave me lots of time to rest up. Now, one thing I did, although Stenvar's still out here getting beaten up, we do actually have a fairly useful weapon for that mage, because it does magic damage, and I have a staff for the uh, archer too if I need it. We're going to start with the same strategy that I used last time, but maybe more actual healing. Because Stenvar is not doing so good. Come on, Sten. Get back up. Get back up. Keep fighting. Oh, I'm healing. Why am I healing the stupid Falmer? Targeting this spell is such a pain. Okay. Stay alive. Stay alive. Oh, yeah, you got him. Good job. Now, this guy. This is the scary one. Um, why am I still crouched? That was not what I wanted to do. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Stenvar, you're doing okay, right, buddy? It's also with him, it seems like, as long as he's not, like, surrounded, he does pretty good. Alright, let's, uh, let's switch to my special staff. Oh, wow! I don't know if it was the staff or, or Stenvar, but that guy went down quick. Well, good teamwork. Good teamwork. He does have a pretty amazing sword, so I suppose if I keep him alive, it's probably half the trick. Alright, back to Firebolt. 
Firebolt in that hand, Healing Hands in the other. I should get a Charged Heal Other spell. I actually, do I have one? Uh, let's switch to Restoration, wherever that one is. I've got to remember the, the shows, the, the, the uh, icons. Um, fast Healing is heals yourself. That one would apply to my Charge, I believe, the extra 45%. Uh, but I don't have a heal other that works like that yet. One day. Alright, another staff. I definitely want to hold on to a few staves. I think that actually should be my goal. Between getting some uh, some recover magicka potions, I think I should just always have a couple staves to fall back on. Because that's kind of my biggest problem. Ew. Is uh, as soon as I run out of magicka, I can't do anything. So anyway, we're still alive. We killed that guy, thanks to them being stupid and not knowing how to open a door, which is always good for me. Luckily, I didn't die. So this room may have been cleared out. I don't know if there's any more. We had at least three or four of those guys run at us. <coughs> uh, yeah, this might be the end here, actually. Possibly. Well, there is a lot of doors still. Let's have a look around up here. Dweemer, 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 Dweemer everywhere. Big door, chest. Creepy wall chests. We'll just take everything with us. We'll have a look at it later. I mean, I say creepy wall chests. They're just weird. Alright, now that, I have a feeling this is where I need to go. And I don't have the key yet. So we're going to have to find a key. Here, key. Where are you? Um, hallway or doorway? I suppose we'll check this area of the room out first. Maybe this door will lead us to treasures. Not deadly traps. Master. Ugh, not gonna happen. I'm just not that good with lockpicks. Expert I can handle, master are a little bit beyond my patience. Hmm, more of the little Falmer sticks. Yeah, the Falmer have definitely been here, that is for sure. And so have the Synods. I suppose I haven't really resorted to um, my, my scrolls yet. Scrolls could make it a good emergency backup spell. I think you can only cast them once per scroll, which makes them really a one-time only sort of last chance you're about to die but uh, perhaps I should keep that in mind all right I have a feeling there's gonna be friends down here no my feeling was wrong well, that'll teach me books more Dweemer metal gyros inside bowls <laughs> crazy dwarves all right Anything special here? Not really. Just lots of their junk just lying around everywhere. Mmm, misty. Okay, there's gonna be something here for sure. You watch probably right out of that little statue or something. It'll fall down. Maybe? Nothing? Being all cautious for nothing. It's unnatural. Built. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard enough out of you, Stenvar. You always say the same thing. <laughs> Me, the Dwemer, got what they deserved. All right. You never know. You never know. <laughs> With the day I'm ah, what the heck? With the day I'm having. <laughs> So it's a more powerful spider. It has some sort of electrical hat. I've had enough of you. We're definitely going to try to split our efforts. Wow, that thing exploded in a nice flash. Yeah, we're definitely going to keep our efforts split between uh, healing and damaging. Or else I'm never going to get any better at the healing aspect. Well, no wonder these Falmer are dead. They run into little lightning spiders. That's particularly scary. You thought metal spiders were bad enough, now it's lightning spiders. 
All right, that's probably the key we needed, and a steel helmet. I betcha Stenvar either yes. has no helmet at all, or is using iron. Sure, feel free to hand me all. What the have you got you for want. helmets? Or no helmet at all? I really should have equipped you better, my friend. There you go, buddy. There, now you've got a steel helmet. He'll probably last much longer in combat now that he has a helmet. I guess, does that mean you don't even have, like, boots and gauntlets and stuff? Alright, we're totally going to have to equip Stenvar better. I, I apologize to poor Stenvar. Scroll. Ingots are kind of light and valuable. Stone chairs. It's mostly just junk scrap, though. I did get the key, so I got the important thing here, so it's no big deal. Potion of Magicka. Oh, that's good. I definitely need some of them. So I've got an agenda. Next time I go back to town, I need to buy some potions. I need to buy Stenvar some armor. I need to check the, the bookshop. I got so caught up in wanting to get back in my quest after my illness, I forgot to actually, like, shop. Get new stuff. Is this the way I'm supposed to be going? Yeah, this is the way I'm supposed to be going. I thought I was going backwards for a second. Can't open that door without more magic or more thievery. Alright. Switch back to healing just in case I need it. Oops. I always get those spells backwards. Alright. You ready, Sten? Oh, he's a little bit behind me, right? Come on, you're almost here. Keep it coming. Keep a march. You need to be able to cast that spell on him so the whole party moves faster. That'd be awesome. Group haste. Something like that. That'd be perfect. Mass haste, I suppose. Falmer shield. Yuck. Nothing I want. Alright. Gavros, is that you? No. I'd almost given up hope. Let me get the door. Thanks. I'm surprised anyone's still alive in here. What the? Hey, buddy. What are you doing here? Uh, what have you done with You can Gavros? put your hands away. Uh, yeah. I came here for the synod, whatever that and is. Just why would you be doing that? Oh, it doesn't matter now. Gabros is never coming back, and he was supposed to have the crystal. Without that, we're lost. No, you're all, all dead too, nothing. really. So congratulations, whoever you are. You found the synod. Just me, alone, surrounded by angry machines and angrier Falmer. Hmm. Yeah, sounds pretty rough. It didn't work the first time. I tried to tell Gavros, but he wouldn't listen. No, it won't be too cold, he said. Well, I was right, wasn't I? Focus completely wrong by the time we got here. The cold had warped it. Yeah, it's Gavros had to Skyrim. cart all the way back to Cyrodiil. Left the rest of us here to fend off the damnable Falmer. Well, that's not pretty nice of him. So yeah, what exactly is this crystal for? It was for? a brilliant idea, really. Don't get Mostly my ad, though Gavros took the credit. Secret, though. Official oh, synod thanks. Business. Thanks. Can't talk about it. Um... You guys are fairly mysterious. Um... I am looking for the staff, though. Are you? Well... I'm afraid I can't help you with that. I need the crystal to do anything useful, and I don't have it. Well, I happen to have a focusing crystal. Would you like this? You found... How in the world? I don't even know. That's it? That's it! I don't know who you are, but you may have just saved this little project. Hey, no problem. In fact, who are you anyway? <laughs> Blaze Aflum, at your service. You are, are you? Savos wouldn't even grant us an audience when we came to you. But now you come here expecting something from me? Hey, I'm a nice guy. I don't much like this, I'll tell you. But you saved my skin, so maybe I could overlook the past for now. I'm kind of new at the college, to be honest. I'll explain on the way. Try not to hold their wrongs no against what me. Said, this was my idea first. The council is going to know that when I get back. That's fine. Son. I was the one who thought of using this. I this get my staff. I don't know what the dwarves called it. Something unpronounceable, for sure. Hmm. From all our research. It seems they were intent on discerning the nature of the mind. This machinery, all of it, was designed to collect starlight. And then, I'm not sure. 
split it somehow? It Sounds very curious. To replace one of the key elements with our focusing crystal. Months of enchantments went into it. Let's just hope they got it right this time. What the heck is this thing? Condensed starlight? Well, as long as you got the that's, staff. That's wow. That's right, Stan. That's wow. <laughs> Good use of your words. Keep moving. Come on. We ain't got all day. This is a pretty massively large something or other, whatever it is. Hmm. It's like condensed starlight, he says, huh? Dwarven armillary. It it's called an armillary. the crystal in the central apparatus Huzzah. and we can start the process for focusing it. I'm trying. There you go. Whoa! Okay. Mm, it made some fancy lights on the roof. How's that? Mm -hmm. Well, there's lights reflecting. Oh, do I have to make the lights hit the little orb yes. things? So how do I maneuver these things? Can I control them? Maybe from up here. Control structure. Lots of books. Oh, let's pick up some books. Frost. I already have those spells, but I'll sell them at least. Ah, that'll do. Alright, so, um... Press the button. Oh, those move. That's fine. So that's the inner ring. It, like, just... Oops, I fell off. I'm trying to look at that. Looks like that button made it just go a little bit too far slightly. What about the what middle button? A sword or an axe middle ring. Made of brass and, steel. and get out of the way. Outer ring? Outer ring. Now, it doesn't really look like they all line up to all the little lights. Because how am I ever going to hit the, the outer ring? Can I, like, move something down here, too? Hmm, maybe I should just get the first one lined up and then we'll figure it out after that, perhaps. Let's put the brain to work. Alright. So a couple more presses and this should line up pretty close, I think. Maybe one more. What we'll just sort of went right past it. I mean, it feels like I'm kind of doing what I'm supposed to be doing, but it doesn't... They're not really affecting much. Hmm. What is the trick here? So this one's over here now. Like, it feels like those lights need to be lower, like, reflecting even lower down. Because how am I ever going to actually line them up to that one on the bottom? Unless this hits, maybe. Try to get that one lined up over there. I'm probably doing this all wrong. I must be doing this all wrong. All right, give me give me some advice here. What am I doing wrong? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now the crystal needs to be focused. It was created so far away. We knew that some adjustments would have to be made. Yeah, obviously Eating I'm not getting it right. Crystal will cause it to expand oh. Which will change how the light passes through it. Okay, you I get need you. to use spells to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There yeah. should be a few basic tomes. Yeah, that's. I, I, I get you. Even more blah blah blah. Uh, Cast the magic on uh, the orb. All right. So I'm going to need some fire and maybe some ice. I get you. And they gave me some other ones. They got like short range ones. The long range ones would be much more useful. All right. So what does this do? Make it go. Nowhere. Or the old crystals. Alright, so the ice made them go down a fair bit. That might work. That might work. Like it no, that's not enough. Try fire that away. Maybe this one's like too powerful. Hmm. That's obviously the bottom, so that's the full ice direction is all the way down. 
too far down. And that's too far up. Okay, so I'm going to have to use the old, uh, the old slow poker ones, right? Can I even hit it from here? Apparently I'm too far away. All right. So I... Doesn't seem to give me a whole lot more control. Just a touch. I mean, it just seems so... You barely do anything and it goes all the way. I need one on each row, right? Like I need the top one to be on the top row, and the middle one to be in the middle row, and the bottom one to be on the bottom row. Just a touch up. No, then it goes all the way up to the top. How about just, just a teeny bit of ice? Like fighting these Dwemer creations. Where's the fun in killing? I don't know how I'm supposed to do this bleed. if they switch. It's like it goes all the way top or bottom with one teeny tiny gust of magic. Um, like that was just the tiniest touch. I think that's the one that goes all the way to the bottom too. It just seems too sensitive to me. Like how can I... Oh, it keeps going. Oh, it keeps going. I was not doing it all the way. Alright, never mind. I'll figure it out. Oh, that's good, that's good. One, two, three. Okay, we got it. I thought I was going all the way from one range to the other with one shot. So it turns out you just keep going and it goes further. Okay, no problem. Problem solved. All right, we can press them all at once and speed it up a little bit. Until they line up. Top one's got a long way to go. Be one more for the top one. Oh, that one's almost there too. Okay, that one's lined up. Good. Top one, one more. Good. Middle one, one more. Alright. Well, hopefully that wasn't too painful, Sten. I figured it out. Yeah, look at this. These results, they're not at all what they should be. You weren't expecting a light on the wall? Should be lit up like the night sky. Oh. Something is creating an amount of interference. It's a map. Something in Winterhold, it looks like. It's a map. What are you playing at? Is this some attempt to stole my work? Huh? I just solved your puzzle. What are you talking about? So what is it? What have you done? I made the things you reflect. Know what we were attempting? Are you here to make sure your plan worked? That our efforts have been for nothing? You're a bit suspicious. Well, explain yourself. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the you heck you're talking about. Just as our work nears completion, and now I can't get any results from this because of something at your college. Do you think me a fool? Do you think I'm too stupid to make the connection? I think you you're a bit crazy. How did you do it? I have no idea what you're talking about. Either you're lying to me, or you have something at your college, don't you? Something immensely powerful. No. Beyond anything I've anticipated. No. What is it? No. Uh, I don't know. Nothing. So you do have something. <laughs> Whether this was intentional or not, it suggests some interesting results. I shouldn't just be telling everybody about that, I'm sure. So, like, can you help me with the staff? I pooped your thing yes, up. Yes, the staff. Interesting. I can't explain the details. That would be giving away many secrets the Synod have learned over the years. All I want to know is how to get the staff. Also, I doubt you'd be able to comprehend the details. Oh, shove it. Have you seen the orrery in the Imperial City? No. It was the inspiration for this idea. Instead of projecting the sky, we project all of Tamriel, and then harness the latent energies to overlay the positions of... What's important is that all yeah. of this work was designed Cliff to reveal to us Sources of great magical power. Ah. Purely to help safeguard the Empire. You're just looking for amazing magic yet, items. In the end, only two locations have been revealed to us. One is your college. Yeah, yeah. The other, well, that can only be Labyrinthian. Okay. So, mage from Winterhold, despite your intentions, I've beaten your little game. Even if all sure you've you said did. here is lies. I know you have something in Winterhold the Synod Council will be very interested in. They might. So fine. 
Trudge off to Labyrinthian in search of your staff. I shall return to Cyrodiil and deliver my full report. I have a feeling that will take you longer. This is not over. I assure you. I'll probably be done pretty quick. Yeah, I think you've been in here a little bit too long, buddy. Am I? Am I? <laughs> I think I've discovered more here than I could have hoped to. Um, your trickery won't confuse me. Good luck talking to your people. All right, well, if you're pretty sh you know we should just leave them now. It's, it's okay. I think we're done here. Yeah, we're we're good. See you later, Paratus Decimus, Decimus, Decimus. You're you're a little bit loopy. Let's be honest, a little bit on the loopy edge. But the good news is we apparently know where to go now. The labyrinth, 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 labyrinthine, labyrinthine. I don't know. You got what you came for, didn't you? Yeah, I'm, I'm out of here. Back to your college. Well, that was fun. Let's go for a run down this cool little circle thing. Spiral staircase, pretty cool. Anything underneath it on this side? No, oh, that would have been cool if there was like a little secret treasure back there. Hey, Stenfar. See you later. Bet you wish you had speed like me. So I wonder if this will. Oh, wait a second. What's going on? I wonder if this was you like a way out. Well thus far, but Can't move. Times are ahead. Um, buddy, why'd you freeze me? It is imperative me? that you return to your college at once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You will be called on to take swift action. Rise to the challenge and discover what you. I'll are get to of. it eventually. You are on the right path, and you will prevail. So apparently these guys can appear wherever they want and freeze time. Why do they even need me if they can just teleport right to where somehow I ended up and then freeze time? Like they totally froze time. They could have just came here and read the sign that says Labyrinthine. Or just gone there in the first place seeing as they seem to know everything anyway. Ah, I don't get the Sigic. Well, we're free at least of this death trap. Hmm. Wonder if there's anything useful up here on this mountaintop. Quite the view, that's for sure. Wow. I can see where the troll almost killed you. St I mean, uh, where you played with the troll earlier, Stenvar. Um, what is this thing over here anyway? Is this some sort of tower? I don't know what it is. Oh, I suppose I should go down the ramp. Definitely on top of the Dwemer ruins still. Not sure if this leads anywhere or if it's just a basically climb your way down the mountain kind of section. Sounds dangerous. I don't see anything else up here. You never know what they could stash right at the secret exit like that. Hmm. Actually, this might be a good time to test out a new spell. I haven't tried this one out yet, but I picked it up a while ago. And this actually, seeing as I'm, I can't even really get back up. Yeah. Okay, it's time to try out a new spell. Well, folks, let's see how it goes. Um, is it even on my list? I didn't even put it on my list, because that's how cool I am. We are going to try out probably an alteration. Featherfall. Immediate to fall damage for 19 seconds. Go. Wee hee hee hee. Woohoo. Well, that makes it more fun to go down the mountain. Just recast it on the way just in case. Not that I really fell very far. I was kind of expecting more of a fall than that, but still, it's got its uses. Ah, being a mage is amazing. Oh, Sten, good luck. <laughs> Good luck, Stenvar. I'll see you back at Winterhold.